In this video I will show you how to fix it when your headphones only work in one ear on Windows. There might be a few reasons for this happening, so we will cover a few methods, make sure to stick around. Before we get into the methods, try using a different audio file or video, in case the audio of that file that you're using is set to mono. Now for the first method, try connecting your headphones to another device and see if they work fine. If they don't, there is probably some issues with the headphones themselves. If they did work, move on to the next method. For the next method, try connecting them to your PC using a different port and check if that helps solve your issue. If it didn't, move on to the next method. For the next method, try going over to the sound section and checking if your left and right part of the headphones are correctly balanced. To do that, go to the bottom right of your PC, then press this arrow right here and go over to the speaker, right click it and press sounds. Once you have gotten into this application right here, go over to playback and locate the headphones that you're using. For me it's this icon right here, select it, then press right click and press properties. Once you get into the properties, go over to levels and at the top you will see this button, press balance and make sure that both of these are on the same level. Then press the OK button and OK once again. Now try using an audio file and see if it works. If it doesn't, move on to the next method. For the next method, try enabling and disabling your headphones through the device manager. To do that, go to the bottom left of your screen and press the search button and in here write device manager. Then open up the application at the top. Once you get into the application, locate the headphones that you're using. For me, it's this one. Then right click it and then press properties. Once you get in here, go over to driver right here and try disabling the device by clicking this button and then try enabling it once again by pressing the same button. Now try running an audio file and see if they start working once again properly. If they don't, move on to the next method. And for the next method, we are still in this section right here. For this method, try updating your audio device drivers by pressing the update driver button right here. Then right here, you can either choose search automatically for drivers or you can browse your computer for drivers. If you have drivers previously installed on the PC, I'll just select the option above. And if you get this pop-up, that means that your best drivers are already installed. But if you get an installation going, then try running an audio file and see if that fixes it. That is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.